tip. <laughs> you know? I mean, that's that's in general word, words yeah. to live by. If you smell anything funky, just you know, turn around and go the other way. Don't yeah. drink it. You know? Don't get in it. Yeah, basically, stay away from it. I like that. She's got the hoodie off for today, though. Uh, yes. She needs it out there. Yeah, the, it's it might not be raining heavily where you are, but I, I think we're just going to see until the afternoon just this light, steady rain until the drier air moves in. That will happen later this afternoon, but you see kind of sporadic showers, sporadic downpours too. Not everyone's seeing the rain, but in some spots it is fairly heavy, just uh, near Sylacauga, southern end of uh, Talladega County, moving into Clay County, northern end of Coosa County too. We had some downpours off in our north in Coleman County this morning, also some thunderstorms in Chilton County this morning as well. But, like we said, the rain comes to an end today. Temperatures have stayed Fairly steady all morning long. A little movement in those numbers. 47 right now in Coleman dropped a degree. 49 in Hamilton. They saw a degree increase in their temperatures, but most of us have stayed in the low 50s. The rain moves out by later today. I promise. It's done by the afternoon and evening hours. And then we see some clearing sky and cooler air diving in. It's going to be a very chilly start to Friday morning. Afternoon highs, though, for today, mid-50s. As the rain does come to an end, north winds at 5 to 15 brings that cooler, drier air in. And then once we get to tonight, the clouds will clear out. Like we said, numbers in the 30s. We haven't felt that for uh, the last few mornings with all the mild weather and rainfall that we've had around. So that's going to be a shock to the system. Some spots in our northern counties, mid 30s. I think most of us will stay north of the freezing mark for Friday morning. Can't make that promise for you on Saturday morning. I think most spots will be close to freezing to start off our weekend, but dry. That's the more important thing. Sunny and dry for Friday, Saturday. Sunday, we see a little bit more cloud cover enter the mix, but we still stay on the good side of the rain chances. No rain chances at all for Sunday. By Monday, here it comes. We've got more chances of rain around. The upper level pattern starts to modify once again, and just like we've seen for the last several weeks in a row, after a dry weekend, we start off Monday with more rain chances. I think they'll be in the afternoon, though, for Monday. And then more chances for showers and some thunderstorms Tuesday and Wednesday of next week. That's your forecast.